Hello, welcome back to another Christmas horror review. In this video, I'm going to have a look at the 2016 anthology film Holidays. Now, this was based on all of the American holidays in the calendar, and I'm just going to solely look at the Christmas story on this one. So, this was written and directed by Scott Stewart. And this stars Seth Green, and it starts with him trying to get hold of a virtual reality headset, which I assume is the Christmas toy of that year. Now, he stood outside the shop trying to get in um, just before closing time, and he's, you can see him trying to um, like knock on the door to get in, as he says he reserved one. Now... When the man comes to the door, another person's leaving, and he states that the headset that he reserved, that person's just bought it. So he approaches him in the car park and tries to barter with him to buy it off him, ends up offering him $500, but the man's not interested and walks away from him saying Merry Christmas. A few moments later, he sees that the man's actually collapsed and he needs uh, medical attention. He's trying to grab his pills that are out of his reach. And instead of helping him though, he robs him and takes the headset away. And then you see later on, when he's at home with his girlfriend, she's complaining that her boss didn't give her the Christmas bonus. And it's re she's relying on him now, even though he doesn't earn as much. But she said that he got the present for the kid on Christmas morning. Now, you found out with this headset, when you put it on, it analyses what you want to see on the headset. So when the son puts it on, he's an astronaut on Mars. And originally, when the dad puts it on, he sees something really X-rated. So later on in the night, he sneaks in his kid's room and puts it on again. And first of all, he sees the X-rated thing again, but then it cuts to seeing himself as that man past collapsed on the floor and then you see him in the morgue with two doctors talking over him saying that he would have made it if he'd have got the medical attention in on time so he's quite distraught at this and you see him trying to call a helpline to find out what's wrong with it if it's if there's a reason why he's seeing this he can't take any further though because they're asking him for his username so they can have a look at the visions that he's having but he knows for a fact that if they see it he'll he'll be found out that he didn't help that person so when he gets home his wife his wife approaches him and says that she saw what he saw on the headset and why he did it and he explains that he was sick of being a nice guy and she seems to be quite impressed with this. And then later on in bed, he, he notices that the headset is next to his wife's side, so he puts it on. And he sees the wife flirting with the boss, bringing him a coffee, and you assume that the wife may be cheating on him. And when he puts it on again, though, you can see she's actually drugged her boss, and she's took him somewhere secluded, and she's murdered him. And, and it ends with him taking their headset off and his wife knocking on the door asking if he's awake. I think this um, whole anthology is really good. I mean, the Christmas one I wanted to point out especially, but there is some really good ones. I mean, there's one written by Kevin Smith as well from the Jane Silent Bob movies as well, where his daughter Harley Quinn Smith's in it, and there's a really creepy Easter one as well. But I wanted to do the Christmas one for this one for being a Christmas horror review. This is really good, it has a really good twist on it, and with Seth Green being in it as well, I really like Seth Green, so it was really fun to watch, and with it being, it was about 10, 15 minutes at the, at the most as well, so it was a nice short story to watch. And these anthologies are really fun, with a lot of 
different stories in, especially this one. You can watch it any time of year. I mean, you can watch that Easter. New American holidays, so you have like St. Patrick's Day in as well. But there's one for like Mother's Day, New Year, and Father's Day, and things like that. So there's a lot of cool little stories in there. But I definitely recommend this one. It's currently on Netflix. It's a uh, Netflix in the UK. That's how I, I watched it. So I'd really recommend you watch this one as well. Okay, so that's another video done now. I hope you enjoyed this one, got something out of it. And if you've not seen this one, I'd advise you to give it a watch. Let me know in the comments what you've thought of it. Any um, suggestions or ideas for any other videos, let me know. But any other comments you want to leave as well, uh, feel free. Also, please subscribe to the channel as well to help it grow. I'd really appreciate I really appreciate if you could do that, but if not, just thank you very much for watching the videos and supporting the channel. And I hope to see you in another video very soon. Until then, bye bye.